Dwayne here, phoenixtypewriter.com. Got an IBM Selector 2 on the bench right now, in which was seriously stuck, but it's all seems to be working pretty well. Got a few, uh, huh? Space bar has still got a st sticky something. That's not what I was going to show you. It was the backspace. So backspace correction sort of works here. Correct backspace, correct backspace. But if you go repeat, it doesn't go. Should be going back. So I did a come back here and try to adjust the backspace down here like I've done many times right here's the adjustment for the backspace this triggers up pulls everything that way and uh, should have fixed it usually does but it didn't so when I was back here though I noticed something a little unusual so the backspace drives this paw assembly right here. It's driver, you can see it right there. But if you look real carefully, you'll see that that is moving slowly. So, see that? That should go back instantly. And that's what's causing the repeat problem. It's not springing back, it's gummed up. So if I was to stick a little bit of degreaser right down in there from like a center, I bet it's just going to magically start working. Just like that. And now, and now she goes back. So that part, I haven't seen come up in quite a while, but it does happen. Get some really good access to that part down here. So if you move this over here, you can see right down in there. You can see the driver. Yeah, hard to see in the dark. Let's see if I can get a little light on here. Yeah, can't get the light in there. But a flashlight. Well, you can't see it very well. There's the paw right there. And there's old grease gummed up in there. So there's the paw right there. That's backspace. Paw right there. Get up here. So we can really get to it just like this. Flush it out, and I'm going to brush it a little bit too. Get some access in there, brush my degreaser in there. And of course, I'm going to hit that with some compressed air. Pull that out. Run it a little bit, reflush it, blow it out some more, and I'm going to put some uh, liquid bearings in there. This stuff works pretty good, synthetic oil. In there, get it worked in there for good. Come back here, and we'll hit the other side with a little bit more of the liquid bearings. We'll just hit this spot up here and these little pivot points right there. That's going to solve our, our backspace problem. Yeah. 
Yeah. All right. Again, the culprit is sticky parts. Now it's acting, acting like it should there. All right. Phoenix typewriter, backspace fixed. Have a good day.